guys, so today's video is going to be a theme park lookbook video which has been highly, highly requested by all of you lovely people up there. So today I shall be giving that to you. All the outfits are super duper simple, easy and very, very plain. I just try to keep it really, really minimal because when it, goes to, when it comes to theme parks, I personally prefer to keep it very, very simple there because, you know, things can happen there to your clothes and they can get damaged so I like keeping it nice and simple. The hijab style I'll be wearing with all these styles is my everyday hijab style because that is like the most secure out of all my other hijab styles Well, I suppose other ones are secure but I just feel really comfortable in this one which is why I tend to wear this one. Also I wore this one to like other theme parks and it's been absolutely fine like it stayed perfect throughout the whole day and I also went to Alton Towers a few days ago and I went on all the big scary roller coasters and I even went on the smile and my scarf was just like in shape for all the photos so I was just like yes I love it. It wasn't like climbing down half my face or anything during the rise which is very good, very good. So yeah, if you'd like to know how I do this hijab style, I'll have a link to that in the description bar below so you guys can check that out if you'd like to. Also with my outfits, I did like a tiny bit of layering, you know, with a jacket or so. Because when it comes to theme parks, it can get really hot or really cold, so if you've got a jacket on, you can take it off if you need to, a put it on if you need to, and all the ones I picked are fairly thin-ish, so you can put them in a backpack or tie them around your waist if you would like to. Anyway, I think I've mentioned absolutely everything there is to mention, so yeah, now on to the lookbook. This whole lookbook video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully, it's helped you guys. And if you guys do have any like suggestions as to what other kinds of lookbooks I should do, then leave them below. I know I am doing like a casual everyday wear, like to go to school, just like everyday general wear. And I'm also going to be doing like an autumn one. So if there are any others I haven't mentioned, then list them below, and I will try and do them and add them to my little list of things to do. And yeah, guys, until next time, bye.